Welcome back to the channel, today's royal news. Queen Elizabeth II's savage comment after meeting royal baby laid bare. Lilibet Diana is Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's second child and was born on June 4th, 2021. Her birth was announced by Meghan and Harry with the touching meaning behind her name, honoring two important figures in Harry's life, his mother and grandmother. Despite the tribute to the queen, whose childhood name was Lilibet, she has not yet met her great-granddaughter and has not seen her great-grandson for a long time. The Duke and Duchess's son Archie Harrison is two years old and has spent the majority of his life outside of the UK and away from the royal family. In part, the coronavirus pandemic has played a role in keeping the family apart as travel has been restricted and borders closed over the past year. Now, royal fans have been speculating when the Sussexes will next return to the UK and Lilibet will meet her royal family. One said on Twitter, Will the Queen get to meet her newest great-granddaughter, Lilibet Diana, anytime soon? As the date could be fast approaching, a newly resurfaced report reveals the crude joke the Queen made after the birth of Prince William. Prince Charles and Princess Diana welcomed their first son on June 21st, 1982. According to a 2014 Daily Express report by royal correspondent Camilla Tomini, Charles sounded like any besotted new father when he wrote to his second cousin, Patricia Mountbatten, announcing the happy news. Charles is quoted as saying, The arrival of our small son has been an astonishing experience and one that has meant more to me than I could ever have imagined. I am so thankful I was beside Diana's bedside the whole time because I felt as though I'd shared deeply in the process of birth and as a result was rewarded by seeing a small creature who belonged to us, even though he seemed to belong to everyone else as well. However, Miss Tomini claimed the Queen reacted in a very different way to her grandson's birth. The Queen reportedly said about William, thank goodness he doesn't have ears like his father. Having jovial responses to royal births seems to be a popular trait in the royal family. According to a 2013 Netflix documentary, The Royals, Philip casually met his newborn son, Prince Charles, commenting that he looked like a plum pudding. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the content, please like, comment and subscribe for more.